How to be a good husband. If God has given you a wife, you are called to love her, to understand her, to honor her, to lead her, to provide for her, and to sleep with her. You are called to love her. Ephesians 5 verse 25 says, Husbands, love your wives as Christ loved the church. Christ loved us so much that he was willing to give his life for us. And even so, husbands are called to be willing to do everything for their wives. And that's a very high calling. And we need to depend on the Lord every day to love our wives as the Lord wants us to. We are called to understand her. Many, most men think women cannot be understand, cannot be understood. But if you're a husband, you're called to understand at least one, and that's your wife. So you have to listen to her, you have to ask her questions, and you have to understand that her feelings do not work in the same way as your feelings. You are called to honor her. 1 Peter 3 verse 7 says, showing honor to the woman as the weaker vessel. You and your wife are of equal worth because you both have eternal souls. But because she is weaker, you need to honor her in a special way uh, to show her that you realize her worth. And therefore, you also need to protect her. Feminism tries to do away with the differences between men and women. But men are called to honor and to protect women, and especially their wives. And in the grind of daily living, do not be harsh is a very important rule in honoring your wife. We are called to lead her. Ephesians 5 verse 23 says, The husband is the head of the wife, even as Christ is the head of the church. A happy marriage is a marriage in which the husband gives loving leadership to his wife and takes care of his family. You are called to provide for her. Ephesians 5 verse 29 says, The husband should nourish and cherish his wife. You are called to sleep with her. 1 Corinthians 7 verse 3 says, The husband should give the wife her conjugal rights. And so that means that even in the sexual relationship, the husband is giving, not taking. He is focused on her pleasure, not in the first place, his own pleasure. The Bible is celebrating sexuality, but it says it should take place within the boundaries that God gives us, that is the boundaries of marriage. And therefore every husband is called to be faithful to his wife. Having a wife is a blessing from the Lord. If God has given you a wife, honor him and honor your wife by living according to the rules that God has given you.